Novices again now, but chases this time. It's the Dipper Novices Chase. Two mile five furlongs again. Over the larger obstacles, a small feel for this. This is a grade two, whereas the hurdles are grade one, and it's Domes of Pang at the top for Darren Thompson, Sierra Vista Fair, Vinnie Gerard, Lordstra Dancing, or Derek Hinton, the Miss Joshua Sutherland, Radiant Heart, Leon Van Rensburg, Seagold, David Hooley, and Tight Craig Beckwith. Field of seven for this, and away they go. And Domes of Panga. It's going to be the first one to show from Sierra Vista Fair and Lawstra Dancing. In the miss, the leader is refusing to settle, pulling for its head. And wants to go quicker than the jockey wants it to. Also didn't drop the first. In fact, quite a few of them made a mistake there. The miss, in particular, didn't jump it well at all. She would have figured from the backdrop we have moved to Cheltenham now. Those two races that we just had were tagged on from the back end of last week. I don't know. I'll figure out how the schedule's gone. These days it's all got a bit jumbled up since we extended it to 13 races a day. As they get over the next, when I first started, you know, the contact, it was just 10 races a day, would you believe? Then it went up to 12, and then it went up to 13. Plus, as of last week on the flat anyway, umpteen bonus races, which does make it a little bit overkill for the amount of people who still got involved. In terms of Panga and Sierra Vista Fair, our next of course subsequently when they changed that to 13 days they didn't necessarily balance up the day's meeting so that's why we have some bizarre situation i think the ascot gold cup was race one last week and they get over on day two anyway they get over the fourth we'll stop talking about the flat and stuff get back on with a race terms of panga and sierra vista fair disputing the leaders they get to the fifth and that time the mistakes are at the back uh launched for dancing radiant out and tight all made mistakes out in the back Domes of Panga and Sierra Vista Fair disputing the lead from the missing second and third, sorry, then Lawshaw Dancing is fourth and Sea Gold and Radiant Heart is tight. Just the back marker as they get over the seventh, which they're all safely over, although Radiant Heart jumped it slowly again at the back. They've got a circuit ahead of them now and they race out away from the stands up the hill towards the back part of the track. The Domes of Panga leading by a length and a half to Sierra Vista Fair who's three lengths clear of the Miss who's in third and Titan and Lawstra dancing together with Seagull tucked in behind them and then finally Radiant Heart who's just now been pulled wider on the track as they get down the back part of the course and Domes of Panga towards a four at the back there Seagull's gone so Seagull out for David Hooley as they get to the water and all safely over the water with Domes of Panga leading by two Sierra Vista Fair second Tight is third and then Lawshaw Dancing four the Miss has dropped back into fifth now and Radiant Heart the back marker as they get over that big ditch and all safely over that one we'll jump that one well and Sierra Vista Fair now coming to join Domes of Panga as they get over that 11th and they're all safely over the 11th with Sierra Vista Fair probably just going on now by about a neck. In terms of Panga second, Lawsha Dunsing third, the Miss is fourth, then Tight and Radiant Heart is the back marker. Heading to number 12, another big ditch. And over that one they go, all safely over that one. The leader in the green jacket, Sierra Vista Fair, travelling well as they race downhill. All this tricky fence and they get over that one. Oh, there's a four at the back there, Tight. It looked like he just made a mistake, but the jockey slipped out the side door. So two down now, five left. As they come to the next, and Domes of Panga has regained the lead and has quickly gone on into a four and lead. Also, Sierra Vista Fair now trying to respond. The Miss is back in third, then Lawson Dancing four and Radiant Heart five, who've both got work to do, but there's still three to jump and plenty of racing still to be done. Domes of Panga in the lead getting into this one. Jumps it nicely in the lead from the Miss and Sierra Vista Fair in second. The Miss is now travelling strongly in second. Lawson Dancing and Radiant Heart are trying to run on. They've just got two to take. And it's Domes of Panga, who's been in the lead pretty 
pretty much all the way apart from that short period of time where the lead was taken over by Sierra Vista Fair who's now back in third and starting to try to run on again but Domes of Panga clear with two to jump Domes of Panga from the Miss who's back in second Sierra Vista Fair and Radiant Heart are trying to run on over the second last they go and Lorstra dancing at the back but it's Domes of Panga and the Miss who are clear with one to jump it's going to come down to the jump I think as they come into this final fence and the Miss soars over it and suddenly bursts clear and is suddenly four lengths clear five lengths clear racing into the final furlong one good jump at the last put this race completely to bed although Sierra Vista Fair is running on gamely in second and he's actually eating up the ground and I don't think he's going to eat it fast enough to worry the miss and the miss takes it from Sierra Vista Fair second Domes of Panga third Radiant Heart fourth and then Lorstra dancing was the last one to finish of the five that did finish so Joshua Sutherland gets himself on the board that's four races and four different winners so far four different trainers winning today so far so that's good the miss is the winner for Joshua Sutherland Sierra Vista Fair Vinnie Gerard second Domes of Panga Darren Thompson third Radiant Hartley on Rensburg fourth and Lorstra Dunstan for Derek Hinton was fifth